Time now for Nancy O'Neill and the Suncoast Art Gallery Guide. Nancy's the manager for the Ringling College of Art and Design Made by Gallery. Nancy? This week, we visit the Harmony Gallery in the Beatrice Freeman Symphony Center to check out Lewis Miller's exhibition. On display is Miller's collection of African and Floridian animal paintings. Miller tells us how watercolor, oil pastel, and oil on canvas lend themselves to realistic depictions of animals he portrays. The textures of the animal fur and, and their bodies, they need some kind of medium that you can either scrape away or you can um, feather in nice and, and lightly with, oil, with watercolors. Each one of those techniques has a strength that can be used and that's what I really like to work with. Lewis's artistic process begins in an area that might surprise you, biology. In the animal portraits, uh, just like when you draw a human, you need to know what is going on inside. So you need to know the, the muscle structure and the, and the bone structure so that when you're painting it or drawing it, you can understand why something is formed the way it is. And it really does influence the way you paint it. The Harmony Gallery is open Monday through Friday from 8.30 to 4.30 and whenever the building is open to the public. A portion of the proceeds from the sale of Miller's art will be donated to the Sarasota Orchestra. The public is invited to reception for Miller on Wednesday, October 21st at 5 p.m. and the show will run through October 30th. I'm Nancy O'Neill for the Suncoast Art Gallery Guide and I'll see you next time.